Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's the first time you're watching, welcome. So today is a day that I'm going to be accountable for my actions. And it's not what you think <laughs> before you start. I, over the past nine months, I've put on an extreme amount of weight. And I need to get back to the basics and understand why I'm doing it. I know why I'm doing it because I'm under a lot of stress. And for those that are out there, we do stress eat. A lot of us do stress eat and a lot of us go the opposite way and do other things. For me, I eat when I'm stressed out. I eat when I'm under pressure. I eat all the wrong things. I have all the bad stuff. Like this morning, if I'm being honest, I had four large pancakes with chocolate chips and maple syrup to myself. And then I was tempted to make some more. With fat cream. But after eating it, I didn't feel any better than what I was before. And I have to come to terms and the understanding that I do stress eat and I need to stop this now because it's getting out of hand. It's now at the point of I can no longer fit in my clothes. I can't do the activities that I want to do because I'm in so much pain with my back, um, with regards to my back. I had a back injury about a year and a half, two years ago nearly now. And due to that, I can't do set things. And with my weight as well, it's it's damaging the situation further. And I am admitting to that. I am holding my hands up and admitting to it, literally. And I just need for you guys to help me hold myself accountable. I am currently going... I will show you, well, in fact, I'm not going to show you my current weight, but I'm going to set myself a goal of I need to lose five stone. So I need to lose, I'm setting myself a goal right now. I'm going to film this chapter every two weeks my journey for two weeks solid this is my vow to you guys and my vow to myself something needs to change i can't keep doing this i've got this back injury that i've never had injuries like this before and it's stopping my mobility and because it's stopping my mobility I've been told by my doctor I need to lose weight and I know I need to lose weight but because I stress it, it's not helping and if I'm honest the things that I'm going through <laughs> I really could do without to be honest I really really could do without the whole nonsense and everything else so this video this first video that i'm doing this is my first chapter in my journey to lose weight and i need you guys to hold me accountable if you see me out on the street if you're in the northwest in the uk and you see me on the street don't hesitate in approaching me and speaking to me and seeing how i'm doing and let's start talking to each other because when a lot of us are under stress you can generally tell when somebody is underneath a lot of strain and if they need help they're not necessarily going to ask like i'm not the type of person to ask for help if i need it until i actually really need it 
and this is me asking for your help to help me to help anybody else that's in a similar situation where they do stress eat or they don't eat enough when they're stressed and they don't sleep and I'm going to do this diary and I'm going to upload it this is my vow I'm going to upload it every single Friday not every Friday I think yeah every other Friday as of today today is Friday I'm going to be uploading this this will be uploaded shortly and then I will upload my next one in two weeks time and then another one in two weeks and I'm going to show you my progress because something needs to be done now and I hope that you join me on this journey so I think my next chapter I will weigh myself and go from there I feel I am waiting for a, a doctor's appointment to check on my current health status to make sure that I am pretty much good to go I am going to take you to the gym with me I am going to take you on long walks and you're going to be hearing a lot of me talking and you're going to get sick of my voice <laughs> and there's going to be a lot more so from here on out I will be uploading my normal vlogs every Wednesday and then every other Friday I will be uploading each chapter as I take you guys to hold me accountable through my journey of my weight loss and I hope that you can join me if there's any viewers out there that do live in the northwest that would like to physically join me in the gym by all means come and come and join me because I do need a gym buddy if you see me out in the street and you just want to come up and say hello and you know come and be in the vlog then don't hesitate in doing that either I would love for you guys to come and chat to me and we'll go from there in all honesty I think what made me realize that it needed to stop was and this is really embarrassing to admit on the way back from Amsterdam which was quite recently I got on the plane I sat in the seat and this is really embarrassing for me because this has never happened before at all, ever. I couldn't fasten the seatbelt. And for many of you guys that are out there that this has ever happened to, it's really embarrassing. I couldn't fasten the seatbelt at all. There was like that much away from the buckle and, and the, the clip. And it was really embarrassing for me. Now, I know I've put on weight as well because my clothes are really tight on me now, whereas they used to be really loose this time nine months ago. And I've been through a lot of things recently and I'm not going to divulge or go into them or anything like that. I just, it's not an excuse as to why I've been doing this. It's what I've been doing with my stress eating and constantly eating is a result of what I've been going through and that is not an excuse guys that is far from it far far from it so I'm going to end it here and I hope you guys join me in the journey that I'm going to be taking from here on out I promise you and this is my vow now guys that every Wednesday I will upload a normal video and then every other Friday I will upload this video one of these chapters in my life and I hope you join me on the chapters so with that being said guys thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one so bye